Good morning, everybody. Oh, this is already buzzing. What's the time? 10 to 7. So dark. So, Wednesday. Long time no see. I really haven't picked up my camera in the last week. I've just been a bit busy, you know, it's like... And the weeks are just... I feel like... I can't even believe it's Wednesday already. Like, the weeks are just flying by. We've got this week, we've got... Well, the rest of this week, next week, and then I'm off for two weeks. The first week is half term week, and then the first week of November I've got off as well. So, um, yeah. <laughs> How are you doing? How are you doing? So cute. But yeah, nice little, Hi, mommy. Nice little day of Mars. Hi, mommy. Today. Hi, Miles. Bye. So yeah, me and Miles today, Graham's at market, got to get the kids to school, Violet's actually got a school trip today, she's going to Ma no, Ma I Ma no. I remember going to Mawalzi actually. Yeah. Okay. Do you remember what we're going to do today? What did I tell you last night? Do you remember? Yeah, so I think plan for this morning, and then get the kids off to school, bless you, and then go feed the ducks, do you want to go feed the ducks? Do you want to feed the ducks today? Mommy. Yeah, with mummy. Yeah. And then, and then what we're gonna do? Uh, no, I'll still be at school. Uh -huh. What else are we gonna do? Uh -huh. Fish. We're gonna, yeah, we'll probably see some fish. Yeah. <laughs> but we're gonna go swimming, aren't we? Uh -huh. You're gonna go swimming with mummy. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna feed the ducks, and then we're gonna go swimming. Yeah. We try and do swimming once a week and it's just, it's fun. We don't do it go for very long, like half an hour, 45 minutes. It's just enough. It's a little activity. It completely wipes them out, which is amazing. Not a lot wipes miles out at the moment. So that's always good. And then, you know, it's just, we can get a coffee after and there's like a little soft play in there so he can just play as well. So that is basically our plan for the morning. Um, just have, have some time together. He's been in nursery for two days, so it'd be nice just to spend some time together, play, probably come home, do some chores. Standard. <laughs> Although the house is pretty, pretty tidy as of late, and I've caught up with my washing. I did another load yesterday. I've got more. He still loves his little workbench, don't you? He got this for his birthday. Huh? It's in my Amazon shop, I think. I Go on, then you're going to tap it. <laughs> That's it. It's like a little truck. And you put all the bits in there and then it folds up. Hiya. Hiya. And it comes with a little spanner, screwdriver. And you've got the, you've got the hammer, haven't you? This little garage though, or say big garage, is probably his most used toy. He absolutely loves this. It's the biggest bargain ever. <clears throat> yeah, you love this. The crane is just the favourite, isn't it? It's got magnets on it, so it just attaches to lots of things, which makes it even more fun with the track. Um, yeah, he loves this. Thank you. Oh, now it's having a disco. Disco. You have a disco. Dancing. Disco. Disco. We had a disco last night with Daddy, didn't we? Did we have a disco last night? Daddy. With Daddy. <laughs> I know, it's nice, isn't it? It's like purple now. Uh, school trip today. Come on, Vi. Morning. I'm going to make my bed. Today. I changed sheets yesterday as well, so it's another job done for the week. I've just finished off the kids' lunches. Violet's obviously on a school trip, so they want a throwaway lunch. So everything just needs to be disposed of that day. Kind of annoying, but 
um, it's fine. So she's got a bagel. I've actually frozen her smoothie, so it will defrost, but also keep things cool as well. Mini pepperami. She's got a penguin, an apple, and some hoops. And then she's got some grapes and um, a cucumber, little mini cucumber as well. That's her look. Throw away lunch, and then Alistair's pretty much got some. <coughs> right, we are pretty much ready. I'm just going around every room, just trying to like pick up little bits, <laughs> getting Miles dressed. I don't know if this is a good thing or not because I'm kind of a bit worried because we're going out, but he has decided he wanted to wear pants. I was changing him, stinky as nappy, and was like, no, pants, pants, and he literally opened his drawer, pulled out his pants, and I was just adamant he wanted to wear them, which in some ways is really good. It really shows that he just wants to wear them and whatever. But you know when you're like, we're going out for the day or going out for a few hours. I'm a bit kind of anxious, so I'm packing extra pairs of pants, trousers, socks, and um, yeah, it's kind of threw me off a little bit because I obviously didn't plan on this. We're not potty training. He's very independent, still going on the potty at home. You know, I don't even have to remind him, tell him, whatever. He's brilliant. But I don't know, I'm just, <laughs> I'm not quite ready for that yet because it is, you know what I mean? When you know they're ready, it's done really, really quickly. But I don't know if he's really ready to like go out in pants. <laughs> I don't know. He might blow me away and be amazing, but I've told him, tell mummy when you need a wee. But anyway, I'm packing up some bits, just finishing packing. There we go, two nappies, two pairs of trousers, two sock, two pants and two socks, and one sock actually. Um, and then I've got some nappy bags as well, because that, I've got some in the car anyway, but for like change of clothes, like wet clothes, I mean, it, it may be needed, but that is pretty much, packed the kids are all outside letting chickens out letting the rabbit out feeding him you know what i mean just doing the usual rounds in the morning right big kids dropped off just got some petrol um just parked at the park now so we're gonna get we're gonna feed the duck something miles i've done it in a while um so i think you'll find that fun a little bit of time as well because you we can't actually go into swimming to about half past nine so yeah Filled up, I say filled up, we're only allowed a maximum of 30 pounds in our little local petrol station, which is fine for me. But um, yeah, a yeah, little, little meltdown. He hates it when I go into the sick petrol station. Don't know why, don't you? You little cry. You watching trolls? Are we gonna, what are we gonna feed the ducks? Oh, and he's still in pants, the same ones. So far, so good. It's a bit wet, isn't it? A bit wet. Is that good? So sunny today, isn't it? Nine degrees, pretty nice. Can you hear those ducks? Can you hear them? Bit dewy. Bit dewy. Wow. Yeah, they just cut the grass. Huh? There's a few there, huh? isn't there? Huh? There's a few ducks. They're going to come say hello. They noisy. Are they noisy. Miles, are you eating it? Is it yummy? Is it yummy? Is it? <laughs> bit for the ducks. Bit for Miles. Here they come. Wow! All of a sudden, we got loads. I'm gonna give them some then. 
out to eat it all. <laughs> Crazy. Wet boots. Wet boots. Yeah. Choo choo, yeah. Choo choo, yeah. Uh, uh, purple choo choo. Uh, purple choo choo. Yeah, purple. What else? Huh? What else? Huh? What other colour? Uh, uh, green. Green, yep. Yeah. What um, other colour? Yellow. Yellow. And blue. Hello, pirate. You're a pirate? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Come this way. Let's be careful. Look Mom. at your grassy boots. Look at your boots. They're covered in grass. We had an accident. Whoopsie daisy. But he's adamant he wants to be back in. Pants. You're gonna tell mummy. Yeah, I know. Right, we're gonna go swimming. Yeah. So hopefully, yeah, let's put Graham on the phone. He was like, "Ooh, you're brave." Like, yeah. But you're adamant. He's huh? he's adamant. Let's um, he's having a quick, quick snack at him in nine o'clock. Obviously. <laughs> Anyway, we're going to go swimming now, aren't we? We're going to have a little slow drive down. Did you have fun swimming? Huh? Did you have fun swimming? Are you having your snack? Huh? Are you having your snack? It's all gone. You're a good boy, weren't you? Good boy swimming. Was it fun? And then we had a shower, didn't we? Uh. You like a shower, don't you? And then we've got coffee and we've been playing in the soft play. Huh? Is it nap time? Uh, huh? <laughs> Is it nap time? No. No? Right, we are back. I managed to I'm gonna be quiet because I managed to transfer Miles into his cot. He's been napping at nursery recently for like an hour, hour and a half, so I reckon he's definitely having like a bit of a growth spurt. I received my Simply Cook, so I've got that for this week. Um, a couple of bits for Violet's birthday. Um, I'm, I'm gonna do a separate video. I might try and film that in a minute, actually, although I look an absolute state. But I'm going to the gym tonight. I meet my friend at the gym, so I just don't see the point in actually, I had a shower, but like washing my hair till after the gym, it's just no point, is there? So um, anyway, Graham sent, Graham had some things ordered. He mentioned this actually yesterday that he ordered some like sample tiles. Oh, there's only two in here. Um, oh, they're very similar because we're trying to decide, he wants to get a rough idea of what I want for the patio. We're getting our garden done next year. But to be fair, looking at these, I'm not really into it already. <laughs> it looks exactly what we've got, and I don't really like what we've got. And at the moment, what we've got is really, um, the patio tiles are really dirty, so they're actually, they look this colour, and they're dirty, and I don't like them. It's a bit dark. I want something a little bit lighter. Um, the only downside to that is our garden gets very weathered, just, to, just where we live, and it's very exposed. But, um... Anyway, there were only three samples, so I think, I see what Graham says, but I just, they're just a bit dark for what I want. I want something a bit lighter, because we're going to have a bigger patio space as well, and it's obviously it's all going to go around the pool, I just want something a bit more brighter. Anyway, um, I'm going to open this actually, which is my Simply Cook. I don't know what to do for dinner tonight, I might do a roast dinner, really fancy, and it's cold today, it's like a really cold, like dull day i don't know if we should have a roast dinner or i've got we had beef last night so could potentially do mm, creamy honey mustard chicken or chicken and mushroom risotto i might do that actually tonight i did already just put the swimming stuff on to wash um and when Miles came out of the pool when he, after showering and whatever. I actually put a nappy on him. I just kind of feel like I, I knew he was going to have a nap anyway. I've got to be quiet. I knew he was going to have a nap anyway, but 
<sighs> I don't know. I just, uh, although he may feel kind of ready that he wants to wear pants, I don't feel like he's fully ready, you know? Like I keep saying, I just don't think he's ready. Um, and I think I might just try it. Try it for those two weeks, like power through, say goodbye to nappies apart from bedtime, you know what I mean? Just really kind of go for it because two weeks obviously is a good good amount of time to see. Right, someone's awake, so we've made some lunch. Someone else has got a bit of chicken, a bit of hog roast sausage roll. I've got the same yogurt and I've got a little bit of Wednesday Dale cheese, raspberries and some rice cakes. And we've got a bit of Paddington on, haven't we? You had a good nap, didn't you? You had about an hour, which is good. <laughs> All right, well, someone's complaining of a um, bit of an earache. I'm always quite conscious anyway, like when they come out of the um, swimming pool, just to obviously put a hat on, just because it gets, they just get cold, don't they? And they get pick up colds really easily, but... um. Yeah, you've been happy, aren't we? Oh, so we're giving some pink medicine, some cowpaw. We're going to snuggle, aren't we? Oh, I'm watching Paddington. We're just going to chill for a bit. It's just, all of a sudden, though, all of a sudden, honestly, your ear. Oh, dear, don't poke it. That's not going to help. Huh? Is he going to put the toothbrushes in his ears? Yeah. Oh, no. No. Oh, yucky. Yeah. <laughs> no, chickies. You want to go in the house? Look how big they're getting. Got their feathers. Look at this one. It's so cute. Oh. No, he's eating. Look at his chops. <laughs> he's eating. He's hungry. Isn't he? Huh? He's It's like a wild. Huh? Look at your... He looks filthy. Wild bunny. You going high? Huh? Going high? Yeah. <laughs> you're like you're gonna fall off. Fresh, covered in mud. Someone is tired, aren't you? Mister, careful. Me. Right, God, it has been like this, really good today, and it just taking a turn for the worst. Miles, has, his ear has been horrendous since, for the last couple of hours, actually. He's just been really upset. It was really hard to kind of like console him. Um, so we literally just fudged out after being outside for a bit, and he suddenly just like, you know, just went into this massive meltdown of like pain, I think. I gave him, um, I think it was, I think he had five mil cowpon, five mil baby norofen stuff. So I gave him that and then he literally vegged out on me um, for most of the afternoon. But I did have to go, Graham came back and I did have to go get the kids from school. And then Violet obviously was a little bit later because she was at her school trip. So we we're waiting for the coach. Um, but anyway, we're back now. He seems a bit perkier. He has some daddy cuddles, which always makes him happy. I'm actually just making a cup of tea for myself, but then Alistair wanted a hot chockey. So I've just stuck in some of these, like Halloween marshmallows, and I'm gonna cover it in cream. Here we go, I think he's gonna be happy with that. Monster hot chocolate. Right, I started on dinner just because the chicken needs to go in the oven first. Um, so yeah, that's what we're going to do. Chicken and mushroom risotto. Sounds good. I'm going to use some mushrooms up. This is fruit and veggie stuff from the farmer's market today. These peaches look amazing and they're huge. Risotto is on the go. Just added some more stock. Put some mushrooms in there. Chicken's in the oven. Miles is... Over there. What are you making, Miles? I'm a draw. He's drawing something. I don't know what he's drawing. He's making holes in it. Happy. He's happy. That's good. Isn't it? Are you happy? Yeah. Me. Okay. The chicken has like a portini crumb, which is obviously like some sort of mushroom crumb. Sorry, it's steamy. Whoop. 
Um, and then we've got the mushroom risotto. I've just added a little bit more stock. So there's some left. Um, but yeah, looks looks good. I'm actually tempted to add some petit pois peas because I just love adding a little bit of green. We need some veggies. Frozen pea. Huh? Is that yummy? Um, uh, it would just go straight through the hole. Huh? It will go straight through. It's so tiny. Huh? <laughs> huh? 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 Yeah, it will go through the hole, won't it? Huh? <laughs> That's how it turned out. Looks pretty good. Right, clean up done. In the gym clothes, I've got a really full belly, but I said I'd meet my friend. A bit of motivation at the gym, so. By quarter six, bright and, bright and early really, but I'll be home party, early party, enough. Quit there, buddy! Go party, go party. Yeah, gym time. Right, back from the gym and I had a shower and then we just put Miles to bed. It's um, about 20 to eight, I think. He went to bed a bit later than usual, but I think it's because he had nearly an hour nap on Graham when um, he got back earlier because he was just obviously not feeling right. But actually, since having that sleep, he hasn't even mentioned his ear. So um, yeah, I'm just making my sort of sleep tea. I remember what this one's called. Snoring piece, I think, by the clipper. Really nice. I've been having this a lot recently. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna chill out with Grey. Grey's got back out to work for an hour, or half an hour, something like that, he said. Um, and we've got so many things to watch at the moment. We've been just starting new things, but we've started Squid Game, which, I don't know, I like it, but I'm not really into it, you know? But Graham really likes it, so we're, we're continually gonna watch it. But yeah, anyway, I really hope you enjoyed this vlog. Um, yeah, I hope you're having a good week. We've only got six more school runs to do. <laughs> Can't wait, like, just to be done, just for a week, you know? Um, give the kids a break. And like I, I think I mentioned in a last video, like a haul or something, that um, we're actually going away for, for Monday to Friday. So I'm looking forward to just being away for a couple of days with Graham and the kids and just relaxing, playing games for the week and not doing a lot, to be honest. That's what I'm really looking forward to, just having a lot of home days and quality time. But um, yeah, I hope you're well. And... Um, I will see you in my next video. As always, thanks. <laughs> looks really smoky. Thanks so much for watching. And um, I may see you tomorrow because I'm off tomorrow and I might just pick up my camera for another vlog because I feel like I'm lacking content recently. I just, sometimes it just builds up, you know, and, and then I, before I know it, it's two weeks and I haven't picked up my camera because I just get a bit busy. But um, yeah, I want to try and get a bit better. Oh, it's just time, isn't it? Time just flies. It runs away. Um, but anyway, have a good week and I will see you in my next one.